left of your own planet. They make You've got new messages, Commander. Commander, whatever you did on Tachanka has the Turians sending up. Reeves a bit of a prick, even for a Krogan. But I can't say I'd be too happy if someone neutered me and my whole speech.
Everything okay with the shuttle? Just double checking the inertia dampener coils. It can be twitchy in these UT 47s. But don't worry, this bird's been rock solid. I appreciate your dedication, but I don't want to see you burn out. I know my limits. I wouldn't take a chance with your life. So before this war, you must have done something to relax. Sure. I remember back when the Hawking was based out of Arcturus and I was just a fighter jock. There was this observation deck overlooking the main flight paths. You could watch every ship taxi in and out. When I was alone, I'd turn off the auditory emulators and just watch them drift by in silence. You know the reviews like that on the Citadel. Next time we're there, you should take some shore leave. Clear your head. I don't know. Maybe. Do what you need. But I'll think about it. Wish you could have seen that gun on Tachanka firsthand. I cut the auditory emulator. Sometimes I worry about you, man. Cleared to dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? I need to get to the hospital. Yes, Commander. Welcome to Serta. Thank you for shopping. Good to see you up and around. Yeah. Everything all right? I guess. Oh, I took Udina's offer. Spectre status. Congratulations. Seems small compared to what's going on. Yeah. I'm never sure of Udina's motives. Seems a little too convenient. Well, gee, thanks for your support. I don't need Adina to tell me you're an exceptional soldier. Nor should you. I guess so. He said we'll have the official ceremony soon, once I'm out of here. And after? Any plans to come back to the Normandy? Good question. I guess that's up to Adina. Sure. Let me know. You feeling better? I'm fine. Other than the pile of paperwork the doc's gonna throw at me. Sorry I'm so distracted, Shepard. It's just... What's going on? I heard from my mom. They got out in time. They're okay. Good. That's good news. It is. Did your sister make it to the Citadel? She did. But... Her husband was killed in action. I'm sorry, Ash. Thanks. Yeah. Sarah wasn't much for the military life. We were all surprised when they got married. This war will take its toll. Sacrifices like his give the rest of us a fighting chance. It never changes, does it? I wanted to protect her from all this. Don't blame yourself for this, Ashley. I know. But I'm her big sis, you know. In the fell clutch of circumstance, I have not winced or cried aloud. Under the bludgeonings of chance, my head is bloody, but unbowed. What's that from? Invictus, by Henley. 
one of my dad's sappy poets. It's about not giving up. Right. My sister wants to do a thing at the memorial. Nothing fancy. Just some words about the family. It'll be tough. Keep me posted, alright? 